All right, covering all these cheaters, begs the question, how can a woman stop her man from cheating? And how can a man stop his woman, I guess? And for this, we turn to Dr. Wendy Walsh. She's back with me here. So, uh, Wendy, you say a woman needs to ask her man or a potential mate several important questions. Explain that to She has to think about things before she marries a guy. If she, Remember, not all men are born to be cheaters. There are plenty that are not, and here's how to spot them. First of all, look at his history of relationships. Does he have a bunch of angry exes? Has he fooled around before? Um, there's a good chance he's going to do it to you, too. How much guilt does he feel? Did you know that men mm -hmm. actually feel less guilt than women in general? Wait, hang on. Can I say something here? <laughs> If you have a pen or a piece of, <laughs> right. a piece of paper or a pencil, start, scoring. start writing this stuff down. Fair warning. So, again, so keep continuing. So many people, are motivated, their behavior is shaped through how much guilt they feel. Mm -hmm. So if you're watching your guy and he seems to not uh, have any problem bending the rules at work, even if it might hurt a coworker, well, it means he's not going to feel a lot of compassion and empathy and guilt for you when he's cheating. You want him to not go into another compartment, but to take pieces of you into that mental compartment mm -hmm. and not have an affair. Um, how old is he? Did you know that one study on guilt shows that men feel the least amount of guilt in their 40s and 50s, making it easier for them to have an affair right, in that exactly. age group? Because they feel entitled. I've lived a little. I lived. I, it's my turn. I didn't do it when I was young. I think the big one, though, is something Dr. Drew addressed to. Does he fear emotional intimacy? Mm -hmm. oh, emotional intimacy is a bond that keeps people together, mm -hmm. but for some men, it's a way to water down the milk because they're so afraid of emotional intimacy, they just have a lot of physical relationships and not a lot of close emotional ones. Um, uh, my favorite one, um, what did he score on his SATs? And what I mean is that oh, some no. studies have actually linked intelligence with monogamy, meaning that you could, you're smart enough to make that intellectual decision to go above your animal instincts. Um, okay, so someone is smart like the president. These people are 